You know, that'd be like one of the old e-tickets at Disneyland. I mean, just, yeah. I'm not a big fan of heights. So no, <laughs> that'd no, be like paying no for way. one heck of a I'd walk. I'd rather drive across. Right, I think so. Well, the days of a man getting down on one knee to ask for a woman's hand in marriage, that is a tradition that may be changing, may be replaced with a new one, actually. Yeah, women are going shopping for rings so they can do the asking. We'll tell you about a growing trend next. Atlantis Casino Resort, Reno. Every player's paradise. Coming up tonight on News 10 at 6, fire destroy the flume that supplies them with water. Now daring repairs are being made to help keep water flowing to the residents there. We'll show you how dangerous this work is that's being done tonight at 6 on News 10. Diamonds are no longer just a girl's best friend. A growing trend has men getting in on the action when it comes to engagement rings. Jewelers say with more, they have more women asking a man for their hand in marriage, and it's only natural the guy should get an engagement ring. But not everyone agrees with the break in tradition. If you love him to death, it's a man forever. Yes, I would. Why not? Uh, they're beautiful. I, mean, I think one, one world's smallest handcuff is enough. Ooh, one jeweler says within the last two and a half months, he sold 13 engagement rings for men. Uh, before the proposal, it's dinner and a movie, and uh, it's an award that most movies, films, would rather avoid receiving. It's the Razzie. It's given to the year's worst movies. And drumroll, please. The nominees are Tom Green's... <laughs> no damage to the equipment, though. Tom Green's Freddy Got Fingered. Oh, Mariah, that's a surprise. Uh, is it? Okay. Mariah Carey's Glitter. Sylvester Stallone's Driven. The highly promoted Pearl Harbor. Harbor, and rounding out the top five, 3,000 miles to Graceland, and forgive me for not recognizing the, uh, what is it, you were not, you were you were just joking about yeah, Freddie well, Got I, Fingered, really bad. I was, yeah, really yeah. bad. 3,000 miles to Graceland I actually liked. But. See, I didn't really like it, but you know, there are a lot of people in our newsroom that like all of these movies. I know. All the worst, so it's a very subjective thing. What does that thing. say about us? The, I don't, I don't know. know. <laughs> the winner of the Razzie, though, will be announced on March 23rd, the day before the Academy Awards. Thank you very much for being here. We'll see you back for News 10 at 6.